We're here in Sylvie and Rob, you run Freddy's Beach Bar here on the island of Zakynthos. Can you tell us how you came to set up this bar with your wife? Well, Heather, it's a, a dream that goes back uh, 22 years. 1986, we were on the beach here. Uh, this was Ritz's father's holiday house. We used to travel from Cape Town in South Africa every two years to spend a bit of time with the children and their grandparents and saw the first British tourists here on the beach. And I remember saying to Ritza, you know, we have the perfect spot here for a beach bar, and maybe one day when I retire, we should come here and open a bar. That happened in 2001, when I did have early retirement. Ritza wanted to be closer to her um, aged mother. So we came over, and uh, over two years, we built the bar, opened it in 2003. We're nomads. Uh, we're here for probably eight months of the year, a few weeks before the season to uh, open things up, smarten things up, paint, etc. A few weeks after the end of the season for tidying up. The season is from 1st of May until the 1st of October. In the core of the season, we're working from uh, 9 o'clock in the morning until 1, 2 or 3 o'clock the next morning. Seven days a week. For six months so uh, our lives really revolve we it's like working in a cocoon the, there's a world outside and, and uh, we're totally removed from it then when we close and we're busy closing right now all of a sudden there are no people anymore uh, our lives change we have an apartment in Athens and we go over there and we experience a bit of city life we do normal things like go shopping sleep in read books all the things we haven't been able to do for the last six months. Added to that, I have family and friends in South Africa still, so we always spend a month or two months, sometimes three months, in Cape Town or traveling around South Africa, which we really enjoy because it's summer down there, so we get to have a summer holiday of our own. So what would you say are the things you enjoy most about running a business here on Zakynthos? I would say, first of all, it's a beautiful place to work. The environment is, is really soothing and relaxing and idyllic. Secondly, it's the people we meet and we do meet some wonderful people. Several thousand people a, a year pass through Freddy's Beach Bar and many people come every year or twice or three times a year. So we've made many very firm friends that we correspond with uh, during the winter and uh, it's always a joy to, to see them on a Monday morning or a Thursday morning when they come back for the annual vacation. Mm. Uh, the downside is tiredness. When you're working seven days a week and you're on duty and, uh, and busy uh, for 18 hours a day, it begins to wear you down. Um, the bureaucracy and uh, the difficulties of running a business in Greece is also on the, on the negative side. But I think the positives outweigh the negatives. So there must be a lot of people who come here who have a dream of doing something like you have here. Many, many people have expressed that dream to us. Uh, they envy us. They ask how they could do the same. Uh, Ritz has had several marriage proposals. And not too many have done it. I mean, so many people say they want to do it. One or two that we've known have done it. I think they overestimate sometimes the, the benefits and totally underestimate the difficulties. Uh, and that, that, in general, uh, uh, applies to people who, who simply want to come and live in the sunshine here. Um, I find people uh, a lot of the time do that without adequate planning and preparation. Advice I would give to anybody who wanted to have our life and run a bar in a place like Zakynthos is do your homework, get some experience, work in a bar for a season and understand the, the, the good things and the bad things before committing yourself.